It's Kefka stream now! <laughs> Welcome to Final Kefka 6! Welcome to the game! On this glorious of glory days, New Zelda Eve. Lucky Star is here and says, Dudes! Kafka totally won. Kafka! This is the game about man's inhumanity to Final Fantasy VI. Rain Nero says, Nope. You defy Kafka? Have you seen what happened to the Emperor? I very much enjoy the Kefka voice now. I very much enjoy Kefka voice now. I'm not quite sure why. It's a it's a Kefka story. Where you wake up one day and you're Kefka. I just want more land in the Kefkaverse. I am the Kefkaverse. Oh, right, last time we didn't save officially. Because we left it at a cliffhanger. A terrible cliffhanger. Cliffhanger. I went back, I stole a Genji glove. I found a new way to steal. I also have a ribbon. But none of that matters, the world is destroyed. It's still Kefka's stream now. And all we have is Celeste. And that's it. Oh, wait. There we go. I wasn't targeting the screen. Oh, and we have Sid. Do you like the, the Bitcoin bed? I, I had to find it in the wreckage. At some angles, it looks like he has a big handlebar mustache. I'm not quite sure if that's a mouth or a mustache now. Slide out of bed. Things aren't busted. I, I was about to say, where is the dialogue boxes? Is there something wrong? Oh, so this. Oh, okay, yeah, it's that button. Pokemon and this is very different. Oh, so this. You're finally awake. I feel like I've been sleeping forever. For one year, actually. I thought you were out for good. One year later. A whole year? You watched over me the whole time? How would you feed me? Intravenously. Yes, but uh, now I've grown a bit tired as well. There's only one bed, you see. I had to sleep on the floor. We're on a tiny, deserted island. After the world crumbled, I awoke to find us here together with a few strangers. The world. So it wasn't just a dream. Where are my friends? Where's Locke? I don't know. I only know we're here. Maybe we're the only people left alive. Since that day, the world's continued to slide into ruin. Animals and plants are dying. The survivors on this island lost hope one by one and threw themselves off the cliff to the north. Whoa. Oh. We're starting part two like that, are we? I mean, they committed Sudoku. That numerology. They couldn't handle it. My friends, they're, they're probably all gone. So that's you're the closest thing to a family that I have. We could just live out our lives here peacefully. I suppose so, Sid. Or should I say Granddad? May I just call you that? Granddad, eh? I'm, I'm overwhelmed. All of a sudden, I have a granddaughter. <coughs> My long-lost granddad. It's a game about family. <laughs> hey, you're hungry, aren't you? I haven't eaten in three or so days ever since I became ill. Sid's gonna be okay. Don't worry. Sid's gonna be okay. Nothing bad is going to happen to Sid. What would you like? 
Yeah, unless I ask for a fish, I won't get anything. That's all there is here. I'll go catch some. Oh wait, I just realized. I don't know how to cook. I've been raised by the Empire to do magic and kill people. Oh well. Not even a flame tongue. Celeste lost all of her equipment. Okay, she's got it back now. Um... No one else is going to wield it for the time being. Might as well be her. And I did get a ribbon. This is a very rare steal off of the Atma weapon. The Ultima weapon. I did it with my technique. And I guess Genji Glove. I just dual wield swords, because she's the only one in the party. Ooh, Ice Brand. I, I like how you think. Ultima Weapon Ice Brand. The stream do it working? Yeah, the stream works. Okay. I had a weird chat error before. Like, before I, it even went live. Let's see, go, Granddad! There's a thing about this. You could save Sid, or you could not save Sid. Wait, wait a second. Why isn't why isn't fish gettable? Fish is like right there. It's supposed to be able to go out and grab fish, like that, and you feed him fish. But only certain kinds of fish will do. And what were you doing? Stay in bed. Eat this raw fish. Eat up. Oh, yum, fish heads. Oh, what's nightmares to think you alone here on this wretched island? <laughs> Don't lose hope no matter what. Gotta save Sid or terrible things will happen, but we can just cast Asuna. You have that, right? You have a Suna? No, you don't have a Suna. Well, you could just keep on casting Cure, that'll make them better. I never learned the proper spells for this. I only know how to kill. Speaking of which, what, what do you want to learn? You could learn Rays and a Suna. There you go. Better get to fighting monsters. Grab all the fish. Fish, come here. I can't go out into the water and get you. You gotta come over to me. Got it. The faster the fish moves, the better it is for Sid. That really slow fish, not very good for Sid. And his health kind of dwindles by the second. So you have to fish quickly. Well, I could still talk, I... Want to thank you. This means his health is getting worse. That means his health is getting worse. This is one of the most miserable scenes in Final Fantasy VI. The world ended, Kefka won. You're trying to take care of Science Guy that just suddenly changed sides. And it's very hard to keep him alive, especially when the fish want to be in the corner, like this one. Especially if the fish really want to be in the corner. Your fish? Oh no. Granddad, you have to eat or else. What's the matter? Grant? Oh no. Yep, yeah, here it is. It's so easy to get this scene. Uh oh, he was already in bed. Sid. No. No, you promised you'd stay here with me. The script demands it. Granddad, answer me. Tell me you're just joking. No, the cliffs to the north. What are you thinking, Celeste? What are you thinking? Oh, bird? 
Oh, now this is a very sad scene. The other survivors on the island lost hope. One by one. I don't have a reverb on hand. They threw themselves off the cliffs to the north. What about the seagull? Everyone's gone, even Locke, who promised to watch over me. It's over. This really is the end of the world. What a great way to start the stream, right? Just what a great way to start the stream. Okay, well that's Final Fantasy VI. I hope you enjoyed it. Kefka was the star of the show after all. This is Kefka's stream. Of course, it's not that simple. The telephone is ringing, so last you have to answer it. You can't die yet. It's on the seagull. You gotta pick it up. Nothing but telemarketers again. Darn it. They just want to know about my car's limited warranty. Didn't they know their cars were destroyed? You were watching over me. Why? I'll write targeting again. I don't have a reason to live anymore. All hope is lost. A bandana? No, it can't be. Hey, little bird, you're looking fancy. Where'd you get this? Is the person who healed you still alive? Tell me. There's only one person that has a bandana. Well, actually, uh, Seltzer starts equipped with a bandana, but there's actually a canonical reason. He, did, he doesn't want to be caught wearing the same thing that Locke wears. And it was excluded from other versions of Final Fantasy VI because they thought it was a bug. Gotta go find Locke. I'm gonna have to get off this island. Also, Sid is still dead. I need to leave this island. Your friends are surely waiting for you. Why couldn't you tell us this before? How'd you leave this note? Find the stairs behind the stove. Down there lies your road to freedom. My final gift to you. Love, Granddad. His ghost left this note. If you save Sid, he reveals this information anyway, and opens it himself. Is it behind the stove, right? How do we get behind the stove? Sid, you old coot, how do we get behind the stove? Oh, here it is. It's not behind the stove at all. And he's like, hey, I have a raft. We could have left at any time. There's a lot of contention in the Final Fantasy VI community. Is it better to let Sid die or to save him? I think it might be terrible, but it's better that Sid dies. You have that emotional scene... You find the raft, you find the ghost letter. You get the hint that Locke is still alive. And Sid kind of vanishes from the story anyway. Like he has no plot relevance, like they expected this to happen. Oh, it's a good thing this raft has Mode 7 on it.
So the entire world has changed. Gefka done blew it up good. I agree, it's better for the narrative, says Lucky Star. Yes. We got this big swirly thing now in the middle of the map. I'm not quite sure which town this is, but we could check it out. Of course, we're fighting all by our lonesome. So make sure Celeste at least has something to back herself up. Kafka blew up the world so bad it's stuck in mode 7. Run away! She's got ice! Nice job. Do you want to want to see my swords? Is that sword and that sword. And we have this music. This dirge of a music playing on the world map now. The water is purple and dirty looking. And this is Albrook, which means... That weird tower thing up there is... What used to be Vector. There's no mountains or trees anymore. You see that tower? Yes, I did. That used to be Vector. Gafka's up there, and he's using the power of the warring triad. He's become a living god. Thank you, Exposition Thief. Okay, um, what do we need? We don't really need remedies if we're using a ribbon. I like the Albrook music. These could be helpful. I learned, I learned that the power of teleport is a very great power. It's like 4th D-slip from Earthbound. The first Earthbound. Mother. I was using it instead of manually running. It's just more useful that way. That sparkle in your eye, it's just like that monk who came through here recently. Oh, Sabin! He had that same determined look. Then he said, Yo, dude, you want to check out my spiral fitness? I'm getting swole. I'm almost done editing Bug Snacks, and I've been hearing a lot of Chad. Obviously, there's going to be a lot of Chad in uh, the highlights, because she's just a fun character. I'm a scholar of weapons! The, 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 the Ultima weapon! Y yeah, you killed him! Good job! There's also a sword. They, re they refilled the ether pot during the end of the world, that's great. Anyone who opposes Kafka gets his or her town fried by the light of judgment. Also, he doesn't care about your pronouns. Everything changed on that day. There's nothing left to live for. DKS3A says, my, still my favorite Final Fantasy. Yeah, this one's, this was my number one when it comes to Final Fantasy. The world is ripped apart. Many long sealed monsters were released. That's why there's pellet swaps now. Also, Humbaba, Death Gaze, and eight legendary dragons. We could have actually fought one. We could fight one in the desert. I think it's the black dragon. He's a zombie. Light of Judgment. Oh no, Kefka caught Arceus. If a ten-year-old could do it, so can I! Shields, but I'm double-wielding swords at the moment. So I already have one anyway. Green Berets. Everybody's been unequipped, but it looks like everybody's alive! The menu screen said so. Actually, there's two more spaces here. Who could be left? Empty. Empty. What are you stealing from us? It's hard enough as it is. I finished the Emperor's portrait. It was a true representation of the Emperor as a sweet little puppy dog person. But he disappeared before I could show it to him. I ended up selling it to Owser. I, I sold it to Bowser, a rich man who lives in Jador. Bowser's got the Emperor. It's been a while. Been working as a teacher now, and now I have a kiddo, if you didn't know. Oh! Well, at least you, you found some time to come to the stream. Welcome back. Welcome back to the stream. Enjoy. 
Gigas gloves. That's the barrier ring I don't bother with. Nice code. Nothing amazing here. Nothing quite amazing here. Albrook is looking a lot like um, Sal Figaro for some reason. I'm not quite sure. I don't remember Albrook looking like this. I remember this setup being earlier in the game. Think how nice the world used to be. Here, want to see my flashback? Oh, okay, you know what? It looks familiar now. Thanks. Thanks for the... Baby puke green flashback. She's almost four. Four is still weird. I'm 38 with a four-year-old. I'm a 38 with none, but... That's just... That's my, that's my path in life. Maybe someday you could show your kid Final Fantasy VI. There's plenty of different versions out there. How can you make any deal in a world like this? That day the world was turned apart. Debris from all over the world was drawn eerily to the center of this landmass and formed Kefka's Tower. So not much to do in Albrook, apparently. We got hints about Sabin going north. We got pe Kefka played Twister with the center of this continent. Do we have teleport on her? I don't think we have teleport on her. Nice slender lash, buddy. Have ice. Enjoy. I already have. I have the original SNES, the GBA version, the PS1 version, and Pixel Remaster. She's too young to appreciate it, but she's seen me play it. A new generation of Final Fantasy fan. Then you could tell her that you watched a Chocobo play the game. So, the, 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 you got that going too. Oh boy, do I have to pull out the word bangle? I have to pull out the word bangle, don't I? She'd be like, wow, a real Chocobo? Yeah! And then I'd probably be still streaming so she could watch too. Or making videos, streaming. All of the above. I haven't spent a lot of time with Celeste, so her magic is a little low. She's got lots of magic options, she's just not powerful at it. That's what I get for spending a lot of time with Edgar, Sabin, Gao. Mog. I see Sen is still here. Palette swaps everywhere! I have pre-ordered PS5, got the Final Fantasy 16 bundle, so Final Fantasy 16 will be on my channel soon. So if you want to see Final Fantasy 16, you can go uh, check out DKS3A. Got his stuff. I don't intend to. Not my style. I've, I, I've talked about that plenty. I pre-ordered Tears of the Kingdom today. I'm picking it up during the midnight release. It's Zelda Eve. Obviously not going to stream it. I don't have any options to. You're getting it too. You and like 20 other people, because they asked me to come back at 3 p.m. to get the final receipt from the GameStop I'm getting it from. And it took like an hour for me to get to the counter. Granted, there was like only one person working, and he was trying to do two people at once. The Serpent Trish used to be underwater, now it's above sea level. Crazy fanatics known as the Cult of Kefka have built a tower there. Cult of Kefka? I'm sure that's nothing. I'm sure that's nothing. 
Nothing that bothers me. Ten echo screens, please. And don't worry about the shaking outside. What super balls? And five super balls so I could have fun. Cult of <laughs> the cult of the multiverse from all the land I own. There's still nothing that, uh... Oh, power sashes. Strengthens the wearer. I'll take a couple. I'll take a couple gold armors. Thanks. I'm just here to do a commercial. I don't need to worry about that. I'm good. I'm gonna grab another one of these. I don't know. Just in case. Man, everything's all shaky. What is this, Black Friday? Oh, it was just a street performer. Never mind. Yep, I could probably use an extra black belt. Okay, we good here. I'm gonna go see the street performer. Pardon me, excuse me. Sabin! Hey, Silas. Let's get it. Let's head in and help. Now wait. If I move, the whole house will collapse. I'm lifting your crib, dog. First, save the kid that's in there. I can't hold this up forever, so getting it out quickly. Let's not crush Sabin. Let's just loot the house. Lisa, my daughter, is actually trying to grab my phone to see what's going on. He's he's watching Final Fantasy. He's watching Final Fantasy VI. There's a real chocobo. Also, I really should have put a black belt on Celeste. Because these enemies are... resistant. And they like to attack a lot for low damage. And since I can do two counterattacks at once, I think that would be a smart decision. Oh, wait. I, I won't be able to... It's gonna be difficult. Especially since she's in the back row right now. Street performer. Not as, as long as it's not a mime, mimes are creepy. And it's Al Eliza. Oh, sorry. I'm sure we have plenty of time to uh, do some arranging here. There we go. Yay, treasure! A healing rod. Yay, more treasure! How was I doing again? Okay, you can't... Um, you can't get doomed while you're... The doom won't death us if we're ribboned, right? It just still gives us the countdown regardless. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Imminent danger. Let's rearrange and good luck on treasure hunts and side quests. Come on, Celeste, you gotta move faster than this. Yay, I didn't die again. Go on treasure hunts. The Holy Rod used to be called the Pearl Rod. Because they didn't want to get Christian people angry. Monster in a box! There's still time for this! Nightwalker! Mini Nightwalker! Left side, handle it! Well, that was easy, at least. Kid must be in the basement. Man, th th this giant house with tons of things in it. Can we run from these battles? I feel like that would be more, um... That would be better for time. Yeah, we could run away from these. Instead of trying to sit there and fight everything. Oh, the blood sword. 
I don't think that's better than what we got. Another one! I wonder how they like lightning. Oh good, yeah, they're, they're, they're taking I'm, I'm undead in the real world damage. I'm wondering what to... Oh, there's the kid. I'm scared. Don't worry, you're safe now. Oh, we gotta get out, too. Bloodsword isn't anything special on FF6. It's godsend in FF2. I think it, like, spends your HP to do extra damage. I think that's what it, the, the Bloodsword does. Gotta get out, but with all the treasure. I need to open- I need to save the box, too! Run away! Run away faster! Run away and not take lethal damage while doing so. Jeez, Celeste, why is your level only 26? I think, uh, I think my main group that was going through Floating Continent is like 31, 32 now from all the fights I had. Uh, I didn't really have to do them. That's when I learned to teleport a lot more. I killed a few behemoths, didn't really get much out of it. In FF2, you heal for three quarters damage as you, you deal the enemy. Oh, maybe I'm thinking about a different sword, then. Maybe I'm thinking about, like, Runeblade and it's MP instead. I know there's a sword that takes things from you to do more damage. Just shove the kid through the door and deal with the scorpions later. It's about time! Yeah, that's the Runeblade. Oh. Oh, that poopy thing. I think that turned into a ribbon now, if we could get the mar Narsh. Marsh? It's probably a Marsh now. Sabin, you're alive! But of course! You think a minor thing like the end of the world is gonna do me in? I'm too swole. Wanna arm wrestle? I thought everyone was dead. I'd given up all the hope. Threw myself off a cliff. Unfortunately, I was wrong. I know they're all alive. I've seen it in the menus. We need to find everyone. Then... Suplex Kefka? I know, I know. We smash Kefka. Deliver peace to the world. Man, I'd like to suplex me some Kefka. And I'll make a new hole in this world. East you'll find the Serpent Trench. Where the East you'll find the town of Mobles. Boy, the Light of Judgment really fried that town. Thank you so much for saving my son's life, but now I have no home. I've never been more frightened. Well, at least we got Sabin, which is one of my better build characters. Okay, he's on me. He's 29, but... He's still stronger, and uh, he could probably make a better use out of that Genji glove. So you go ahead and get one black belt on ya for counterattacks. Why do you always want a stone blade for? You know what? I'll use the blood sword anyway. Spyro Fitness is insane. He just shrugged off the end of the world. And all he had to do was swing around the green stick. You just play, dude. You just play. Let's give him two gloves. You know what? That's fine. Burning Fist and Venom Claws. That's fine. He's got a ton of spells. He says teleport. In fact, I don't even know if there's um, an Esper I have that could actually teach him anything decent. Dispel? Drain? Poison? Might as well just take Dispel for the Unicorn. 
Maybe we could take buffs off of people. Head north on the Serpent Trench and you'll find Nikea. So the path kind of splits. Do you want to go to Mobliz first or do you want to go to Nikea first? And get some nice furniture for a cheap price. So we got to find the Serpent Trench. As you can see on the map, it actually looks like a snake. But we finally have some AoE in the party. With Saban. We got that going on with Saban. No, I think Blood Sword is still fantastic there. DK, I think that sword is still fantastic. Did you see that? A hundred percent heal. I think that might be an add-on that I added to it. So we must go to the Serpent Trench. We can't go to, um... What's the place? I keep on I keep on thinking about Marana. Miranda. It's out in uh, on an island somewhere. Yeah, just the heals for whatever damage she can deal. Which in the back row is not all that much. I don't even know why I have Sabin in the front row. All of his stuff doesn't matter where he is. So I'll switch them around, to, just for the better heals. So the, the Serpent Trench kind of has this little umbilical cord. The counterbalance of Bloodsword in a fair few games is what... It has a massively lower attack than other weapons. But it's very viable, as we've seen. Definitely will help keeping her alive when you only have, like, two team members. She's supposed to be the spellcaster of the group right now anyway. So I think we'll just... we'll go to Mobliss, because there might be a chance of getting... Gal. There might be a chance to get Gal. Mobliss is kind of close to Develt, if I remember correctly. Dare hit me? Oh! Luckily, your team doesn't wipe when everybody gets snorted, because I had that happen at least once. Because the regular dragons on the floating continent love to snort. And sometimes they snort my thief, and then I get really angry. Contrary to popular belief, I changed my mind. Can't stop me from changing my mind. I just want the better counterattacks from Saban. Oh, look at these funky things! I'm a Lana called, it wants his enemies back. What can I say? He's a beast! Where's the Velt? Did it like completely separate from the continent and drift north? Because I don't see a Velt anywhere here. We also got Mega Goat. Oh right, everybody has black belts, so that's going to happen a lot. She's unkillable! It's Blood Sword and Black Belt, and it looks like it inflicts Seizure or Poison, too. It's a weird sat status effect. Seizure. Oh, it's dealing damage equal to her missing health. I didn't notice that, but apparently Rain did. Vamp Thorn. Oh, it's a Dracula plant. Yep, she had, like... Oh, wait. I don't know. She definitely took a hit there. Oh, the defense is just insane. They're probably magic weak. Or just really high defenses and low HP. 
These enemies are physical resistant. Well, I got raised. Let's go back and get Sid. We're gonna have to find a boat and go get Sid. Oh wait, I know where my raft is. All we have to do is fuse an engine to it. I learned that from Hyrule. Yeah, yeah, you're correct. 11, 111 one time, zero the next. Now it's a great counterattack weapon. Man, this place is a hike. If only there was chocobos! I think I might have walked past the chocobo stable, actually. That would have really helped. Some peppy music in these dire times. A nice egg. Thanks for the sleeping bag. Mobliss! Doggos! Ah, someone's coming! Is this where Gao is? He'd be playing with the dogs. He'd be running the pack. Yeah, like we, could, we could save some of the townspeople. We could bring them back with Phoenix Downs. Think about it. All this tragedy could have been averted if they just used video game mechanics like we do. You've got so many Phoenix Downs in stock. Just bring everybody back to life. Maybe some of the Thamasa people made it and they could use their magic to help out. Wherever Thamasa is now. Sometimes there's elixirs in the clocks. I'm just saying, there's options. It doesn't need to be this miserable. Too many problems could be solved. You're gonna have to fight your way in here, chumps. Okay, I'll take them. Time to suplex a kid! Terra! Mama, are these your friends? Mama? Wow, you got busy. Oh, I'm glad to see you. You're alive. I, I missed you. Terra, come on, let's go. Unless we stop Kefka, I was lost. I... She's getting packed, right? She's getting ready? My mama and papa's protected us, so now they're all gone. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is the cast of Final Fantasy VIII. Dwayne and Katarina are the oldest. Terra's our mama, and they're our big bro and sis. Everyone here tells, tells Ka Terra Mama, except for me. I call her Terra. Badly hurt soldier here in Mobliss went to sleep and didn't wake up. Did you use a phoenix down? I'm happy because Terra's here. Pardon me, kid. Pardon me. Excuse me. I saw Dwayne take us and Katarin. You're not going to take Terra away, are you? Oh. Well, I mean... Terra's helped us all to survive ever since she's been here. It felt hopeful for the future. This is our village. You can't just walk in here and start barking out orders. What the heck with you? I'm a general! I'll have you know. Not like that means anything in this day and age. I think she's a general? Yeah, she's a general. That's her rank. That is, I... Uh, I lost my will to fight. The very day the world fell, Kefka turned some kind of beam on this town. Almost all the adults were killed trying to save their children. It feels like there should be music here. Setting this way, protect the kids!
Then they get Thanos snapped by Kefka into a pit. I half expected the dog to fall in too. I'm not quite sure why. There were only children here the moment I arrived. I, I felt needed. She found a purpose. Oh, here comes Jerkface. Can't take Terra away. Whatever. Please excuse him, it's just that if Terra goes, she takes with her the very spirit of our survival. I guess she has people that really do depend on her now. Complete 180 from the beginning of the game. I don't know why these kids need me. They made me feel things I never felt before. Oh, you mean love? At least in the maternal sense? The moment I sensed this, I lost my will to fight. I can honestly say I don't know what's going on inside of me. The more I try to understand it, the less inclined I am to fight. Terra's helped us all to survive. Ever since she's been here, we've been hopeful for the future. I think I already read that one. Well, there's no doing with Terra, I guess. She's got a new home. Help, run! Humbaba's coming! Humbaba? Sounds like a Zelda enemy. What happened to that fighting spirit that you lost? Humbaba is an ancient demon that was released when the world is undone. I won't let him harm this village. But thanks for exposing that to us, Terra. Now I know how to fight. I remember how to fight now. I wonder how Confuse works on Humbaba. Also, where is Celeste and Sabin to help out with this? Oh, oh, but I, that hurt. That is not good. Especially since she has no Cura. How's she gonna get out of this one? Ah, uh, no, she don't. That's the neat part, she don't. It was scripted. Tara, wake up! Uh oh, here it comes. Damn, Humbaba got hands! Alright, I'm gonna suplex this Humbaba. How do you like that? Fight someone with muscles in her own size! It's got some good Thundaras there, but we got some good suplexes. And Runic wouldn't, wouldn't hurt either. Just go ahead and Runic that. Oh, okay, until that happens, yeah. yeah he's got that, huh? Nice 1,000 needles he got there, buddy. That's to, pre that's to prevent cheesing out the, the fight with Runic, huh? Alright, I got this. Correct. No. I reject that. Ugh. I must have accidentally hit a right or something there. That's a simple input. I shouldn't fail that. Oh, cool. Thanks. Thanks. This is exactly what I wanted. Maybe we should take priority in getting Celeste back to full health. Hey, buddy! Rude! I don't exactly have anything stronger than a Phoenix down to revive her with. And he's got a 50-50 chance of hitting her. Thank you! 
That worked. Kumbaba really do got hands. That eh, yoink. Thank you. Now back to the suplex. Flee, run away, his suplexes are too powerful. I suplexed him too hard. I knew it. I have no power left. Mom, are you okay? I'm gonna stay here. I would just slow you down. Besides, the children really need me. You couldn't stop a Humbaba demon. What if he comes back? How about we go hunt the Humbaba? He doesn't seem that tough. Maybe after a little bit more time passes, I need to understand what's happening to me. It said, hey, you went the wrong way. Thanks for scaring Humbaba away in his haste. He dropped this from his necklace. Oh, so he's a Hinox. Here. It's Fenrir. This gives us Quake, doesn't it? What is Fenrir? Where is Fenrir? How is Fen That's a better question. How is Fenrir doing? How are you doing? Teleport, warp, and stop. Well, she could use a teleport spell. That's not Earthquake, though. I figured it would be, since Fenrir is the world wolf that swallows the world with his giant mouth. I figured he would cause earthquakes doing that. What do I know with my Norse knowledge? Something tells me that forest's got chocobo in it. You know what? I'm using teleport. It's faster than running. Yeet out of any battle that you could normally run from. You can't yeet out of bosses. You can't yeet away from scripted battles. At least the chocobos are still here. That's right, Kefka is a jerk. I would know exactly what she's saying. So that means we're going to the other end of Serpent Trench. I just figured I would go this way first. Do the Terra stuff. Because I think you might end up skipping it if you go the other way first. Happy end of the world music. Yay! Everything is desert and explode. this in the mountains oh is that is I think that's mage tower I think that's mage tower in there isn't it it's a place you could only go if you have magic you can only fight things with magic in there so you got to get your magic a game up or that's something else entirely I'm not quite sure what that is now So this is Nikea. It, it's not a port town anymore. Wow, that, that means Moblis really got separated from that, that eastern continent. It got plate tectonic hard. Try to keep a low profile here and hide away from Kefka's wrath. Well, this place looks relatively unexploded. That's good. They got some tents here. I used a few when I was on the floating continent. Rune Edge Enhancer. These are good swords. They boost your magic. So we have a second Genji Love. We might as well use it. I don't think we'll need the ribbon anymore. We haven't really dealt with status effects all that much. 
So, so where did I get a? Oh, that's preemptive strikes. Where did I get a Gale hairpin from? The Gumbaba fight. We're gonna Genji glove double enhancer. They give plus seven magic each. So gone is the blood sword already. It's a bunch of thieves hanging out in the pub. They came from Figaro Castle. Oh, great. It's getting looted. They're gonna mess with the engine. That's dangerous. Boss wants to sneak into Figaro Castle. He wants to get the booty from the storage room there. Speaking of booty, how's Humpty and Dumpty doing? I've been chatting with the boss of this gang, Gerard. He's such a flirt, and kinda handsome, too. <laughs> Escape from Figaro Castle's prison. Oh, the same with Lone Wolf, huh? The last boss perished that day. We met up with Garad in this town. Or Jared. Jared would sound biblical. Out of nowhere, a bunch of huge sandworms burrowed into the prison. Followed the tunnels back to the surface and escaped. So it's Dune! Went to the castle through the secret gate that only we knows about. All right, let's go. Should we follow? I think we should follow. And loot all this stuff like the golden duck. Let's take the golden duck. Take everything not nailed down. The ship's been chartered by the Crimson Robbers. What are you doing? Get away. What are you doing? Get away. What are you doing? Get away. Hi, I'm Tim. So I don't see a, a, a Jared or a Gerard or Gerald. Probably Gerald. His real name's probably Gerald. Sounds embarrassing enough to be somebody's name. Man, I'm spending all my money. I'm spending all my money. Are you wearing a power vest? No, you're wearing Gaia gear. It's not that much of a change in defense. Get you more vigor, speed, and stamina. You got Chocobo. Maybe we have to head to Figaro Castle somehow from here? Not quite sure how. Good mattress for 150 gil. No clock elixirs though, sorry. We're fresh out. Clock delivery guy couldn't make it. Being separated from the rest of the continent and all. Oh wait. Ah, nope, nope. No clock elixirs. He's right. Couldn't make it. Couldn't do it. Surely there's a way to find this Gerald folk. I'm gonna call him Gerald. I'm gonna embarrass him. Strangely enough, that's also an anagram of Edgar, but that's just silly. In here. Can you tell me where he went so we could find him? I'm not quite sure what to do at this point. I know what we must do. But I'm not quite sure where I do it. Figaro Castle is stuck underground, according to that lady. It had worms. It started rubbing its butt on the carpet. There's nothing else nearby. We need this boat. Any other buildings I haven't checked out?
I don't see any stairs. Oh wait, who's this fellow? I thought he was just an NPC. He looks a little... familiar. What's your problem? You're Edgar, aren't you? No, my name is Gerald. How dare you call me by my real name? I mean, my normal... my not normal name. Edgar? I have no idea what you're talking about. I'll take this too, kid. Celeste is having none of this. Look, I'm busy getting ready. We're departing for Figaro on the ferry very soon. Don't play dumb with me, Edgar. Or have you somehow lost your memory? What's going on here, brother? This is not the usual line in this scene. Satman in the normal American version is just like completely clueless to the disguise. But here he's like, yo, bro, it's me. Listen, my lady, I've been known as Gerald, uh, Gerard my whole life. Only Edgar would call me my lady. Uh-oh, busted. What's all the bloomin' fuss about? The words my lady I've used the world over. Yeah, but you sound like a womanizer, too. You like machines. Oh yeah, you you know how to get into Figaro Castle, don't you? Haha, <laughs> do we ever? Then you lead the way, since it's buried. Once we're in, I'll take over. Really dependent on your crew there, I hope they don't mutiny. I hope you don't run into a kraken along the way. There probably is a kraken here now. Anybody got used socks? You know what? Hit the booster! There we go. They just motorboated. Nah, yeah, let's still need to shop. We're shopping here. Shopping for a castle. A sand traveling castle would be very useful right now. Busted that gang of thieves is on the second floor of the inn. Now, at least we know where they went. But what about gear and such? Now you could buy Hermes shoes here. Prince, you could buy angel rings for like. What would that be? Like a 60% discount? It's like a 60% discount. Get them for an auction house for 20,000 or you get them here for 8. Not like I really have that much money now. Nothing left in my hometown. I wonder what those fellows are doing. Those Narsh guards, they were looking in through a window. Wait, is this the place that has, like, this, this is South Figaro, right? Which means it has that dungeon thing. Yeah, you can still go in here. This is where you got the initial Hermes shoes, I think. And this is where Celeste was being held. Ah, memories. I was being tortured in that room. And there's the save point. Hey, I wonder if that... Was there like a clock in here I couldn't access? Oh. oh. There's that. I wonder why that's relevant. The old clock not ticking. Why is that relevant? Wait, battles? Commanders? What are they doing down here? 
They didn't get the memo, did they? I could go find that thing that I left behind. I think it was a ribbon down here. I think there was a ribbon down here. It was like over this way, I think. It was hidden behind a wall. I get the feeling this is kind of an oversight and they never bothered to close it off. Yeah, this is a bug. These are extremely low level enemies from the Celeste and Locke scene, and their triggers are still intact. Somehow. Okay, it's not this room. If I could walk behind a wall, I'll probably find it. But yeah, yeah this, it's not... No way in a million years are these enemies going to kill us. This is where Earthbound mechanics would be coming in handy. I mean, we could just murder them with counterattacks if we wanted to. Wow, Sabin. Sabin, way to go. You killed that dog. I hope you're happy. I swear there was something down here. Really, you're gonna activate our counterattacks like that? Smartest dog on the forest right there. I think it's here. Oh no, that's uh, that's just stairs. Oh wait. Still not quite sure what this is supposed to do. Maybe this is locked? Could have sworn there was a ribbon down here. Second smartest dog on the force. It's one of these rooms. Maybe it's neither of these rooms. There's like a path in here. I'm just, like, mashing the A button, hoping I, like, trigger something. I wonder if I could teleport out of here. I wonder if this is considered a... This is considered a dungeon. Someone's enjoying their car. Uh, she don't got teleport. And teleport don't work here. So it's in a dungeon. Oh well, it was worth a shot. It would have been a bonus ribbon that I probably wouldn't have used anyway, because I know where one is. It's over where the mogs are. You can probably steal ribbons from this part of the game eventually, too. Let's get out of here. But yeah, that's an interesting little side note that th these early game enemies are just like still here. Just hanging out. Wasting your time. So that whole shortcut still exists. Duncan's house? No, oh dear, my husband's still alive and well. He's off training now, just north of Narsh. If only we knew how to get to Narsh. Because it's not that easy anymore. Oh, okay, it's this room. And doesn't seem to be anything here. Wasn't there a save point from the other direction when we looked into that room? That's kind of weird. Did you hear that Duncan's alive? My wife thinks so. Or his, his wife thinks so. 
He never came home. Now she's my wife. Would you like booze? I'm so relieved to know my grandson's alive. That's the password. My grandfather was once a servant to the richest man in town. Great to know. I'm not sure if there's any story triggers here or we could just move on. Oh, I'm dizzy. Stop looking at it like that, then. Souvenir of the Empire, anyone? Get your own mecha battle suit. Only 200,000 gil. Not like money works in this day and age, anyway. These men may be thieves. These men are pawns. At least they have goals in life. You can learn a thing or two from that. A storm in Figaro Castle. That treasure is rightfully ours. Oh, right, we have to go to the inn. That's a rest now. We have to start rebuilding. Guys, it's called a ladder. At least five can ladder. So where's that pub at again? Oh, there it is. The pub in. I thought that would be like a sneaky side alley there. Now oh, all these thieves are demanding our time. Oh, I'm exhausted. The go castle dis disappeared the day the world became unzipped. And then we all caught a virus called Kefka. Some guy came through here a little while ago looking for some legendary treasure with the power to bring back the dead. He was insisting he was an adventurer, but I knew he was a thief. The Storm and Figaro Castle. The treasure is rightfully ours. I don't know what happened to his people. I hope they didn't suffocate down there. Wouldn't you guys know you were in the jail? That sweet little girl stopped coming around after the world ended. Oh, does that mean she die? I think that might mean she die. You gotta constantly remind us, this is the world of ruin. You can't be happy here. Kefka forbids it. Do you mind getting away from the door? Thanks. Ah, there he is. For the last time, I'm not Edgar. Let's go help them. Hang on a sec, I was on the phone. Are you people still here? What's wrong with you, Edgar? Ah, so everything's ready. Let's go. Case of mistaken identity, my dear. Give it up. No, I'm fangirling after Gerald. Maybe Sabin could talk better sense. So they left, right? They're on their way to Figaro now. Or wherever Figaro was last buried. Yeah, th th these thieves are gone. Except for that guy. Gotta get Edgar on the team. We need this cool tech. Now, this is what's left of Figaro. Let's go into the caves. Oh, it's Siegfried again. Pretty dangerous from here on. I'll go in first and clean out all the monsters. Wait here. I got the long sword. I'll take care of Rathalos. So I'm guessing if you left some chests in here, they would have, like, done the Chrono Trigger thing and got enhanced. What? Seriously? Then again, I was trying to do Rising Phoenix. That's always kind of iffy. Uh, 
Oh, they got confusion. Wait a second, she... Oh, wait. Yeah, she's not wearing a ribbon. Are they gonna get fired? No. Us. Us, we get the fire. Wait, how'd that... Wait, how did that... Did he get healed to death? Better heal up, Saban. We're just gonna counterattack everything to death. And, uh, the poison... Heal... Poison heal kill things. Even if it's healing, if you snap the neck, they're still dead. There's no way around it. Just because they gained HP, they're just a corpse at HP. They're a really nice looking corpse. Yeah, it, it, these chests could have been upgraded. That's what I'm feeling. Oh, who are you? You look fancy. How would you, how would you like a suplex? I didn't get his name, either. Dante! Oh! I know a streamer that would know a lot about Dante. Dan Dante. It's the, the, um, the Gravekeeper from Zelda. Because it's Zelda Eve, you know. Please play. Please play. Vinny, please play. Only 20 minute. I swear. I have to use this gun. 20 minute. Got a new blitz. Razor Gale. That's a full circle. Up to left. But you could do wind power. You could punch with the wind. Nalo says, I made it! Welcome! Now, where were we? Here, boy. Here's some nice food for you. Oh, I think we got a, We would have gotten a tip in town about turtles. Presto. Good job! I used to have a pet turtle. I'm playing Final Fantasy XV right now, says Lalo. Now, Sid could do it, I could do it. Wanna get your neck hunted, bro? I'm the suplex hunter. That's right, from the Devil May Cry series, that was Dante. Should have been in Smash. Just like Monster Hunter, should have been in Smash. Uh, try not to kill the party again, say. Oh, oh, that's um, that's a little nasty. That's a little nasty. Ow! 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 Quit it! That Confuse is a piece of work, isn't it? Maybe I shouldn't have put, been putting all my eggs in the, the kill people basket with the, the Genji gloves and all that. Turtle? Turtle, where are you going? Thanks for nothing, Turtle. Oh no, they looted everything. Darn it! After playing the series minus the reboot, I'm retroactively upset he didn't get in Smash. I love Bayonetta, but the OG was right there. Maybe we should kill these guys before they, uh, they get to confuse people. I don't like that mad sickle anymore. Jared, wait up. How are you resisting confuse so easily? 
Humpty? Wait a second. Did that, um, hooker lady's... things... detach? Are there... and multiply somehow? Let's try this wind slash. There's gotta be a dumpty in here, isn't there? Siegfried! On the hum, let's go! Also, that is the weirdest crawler I've ever seen. Why do they die from healing? They heal to death! Is, is, Sabin, is Sabin just doing so much damage on his first attack, they're dead anyway? No earthbound mechanics. Cause that just tickles me. Oh great. Oh no. Uh oh. Again. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for hitting him. He's a weapon of mass destruction when he gets confused. These enemies are menaces. I do not like them. Figaro Castle! Are you alright? You are almost a goner. Gerald, why do you care about these people? It's awful, can't breathe. They need air. They need air. King Edgar, they need air. How long ago was this? Because they really should be dead by now. Can I go to the engine room? Yes, I can. The Basement 2. Edgar said, The Basement's just fine, but what about Basement 2? Again, Death by Poison. It, it tickles me. It tickles me to no end. Stop dying from asphyxiation, it's not that bad. Sabin is just so strong that he's breathing the air in his own lungs. And Celeste is magic. Okay, we gotta get rid of that guy in the back. He must die. He is a priority. Oh wow, one of them finally lived! Black Belt and Genji Glove. Not a bad combination, as you can tell. High Ether, X Potions, Gravity Rod, Crystal Helm. Is that an upgrade for. You know what? This is why her magic kind of sucks, too. The Magus hat is still better than the Golden Helmet. How about we... how about we isn't? How about we isn't on this? I cast Nope. That's what this spell should be called. Nope. You just nope out. I thought that was loot. Where is this leading? 
Should I go in the center room? Time to cast Nope again. Nope. Nope, I don't like it. I think it's like 20 MP each time I cast Nope. This is the other side. Treasure! The Royal Crown! I king you... I king you king of... Punch. It's more for a magic user, though. Also, Tiger Mask is still pretty darn good. But something tells me only Sabin and Edgar could wear this. But yeah, they're looking for treasure. They left a the crown behind. Once you get the airship, if you level up the party to 99 in the dinosaur forest... Every other character you get will also be 99. Also, worms! Here's the problem. What a tangled mess. Boss, ah, so what are we gonna do? The treasure is stored in the room back there. You guys get in there while I keep this thing busy. But boss, it's dangerous. Get going! Edgar! What are you waiting for, Celeste? Give me a hand! Edgar, it is you! Ew, ew, we're, we're sitting on him, ew! I'm not quite sure what Fenrir does. I'm not quite sure what the summon itself does. Hey bro, check out this new move I learned! Ah, that top right one absorbs lightning. No, a chainsaw would be great against tentacles, right? Hey, quit it. Uh-oh. Uh, uh, let go of him. Release! Maybe if I put protect on him. Uh, oh, is that going to protect the tentacle? It's sucking on Sabin. So, uh, th the entire party can't get grabbed, right? They, they wouldn't- they wouldn't do that. Uh, no, th th they would do that. Okay, never mind. Because it's not a death sentence. It's not like, uh, that one boss from Final Fantasy VII. You know the one. Them go! Quit sucking! Okay, bottom left absorbs scolds. Noted. Let us do something. Definitely gotta cure that. Hat! Denied! I'm just gonna go ham on the AoE. Surely one of these things is gonna die eventually. Whatever level Celeste is will be the le level of whoever you find. So if you grind up Celeste a whole bunch, you could get some high-level people. But the thing is, when people get grabbed, you can't exactly heal them. Thanks for letting go of his head. Maybe I should use those ribbons after all. 
important info for my eventual re replay. I'm certainly not going to be farming on the off screen to get like level 99 on Celeste. What do you what do you got to help in this situation? Except maybe vanish. These things aren't quite magical. No, they can't grab them, right? Everything's gonna miss. Hey, I have a solution to our problem. It's called Hope Bio doesn't get cast on us. That's it, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Why can't I Fenrir anymore? That's weird. Okay, nope, they can still get grabbed and they lose Vanish when it happens. It's considered magical, I guess. Chainsaw is gonna try and insta-kill them. Let's use Drill. No! Less bullcrap tentacles! Don't chainsaw your tentacles, drill your tentacles! That's how you get it done. I think that was a bad input. Oh, no! No! I could have sworn I didn't hit left on that one. On the old SNES, that would be up, up, right, right, down, down, left. But this one insists you do, you do the Street Fighter thing. Why the stupid farce? Well, I heard Figaro had an accident, so I wanted to help, but I didn't know where to look. Then I heard of those idiots that escaped from the prison. You needed to use them. Bingo! And I obviously couldn't let them find out I was the king of Figaro. Considering that you threw most of them in jail to begin with. You could have told us. Uh oh, let's hide! Why are you hiding? You're the leader! Boss? Boss? Must have been eaten by that thing. It wasn't even much of a monster. More like Kentai. Oh well, let's go. They robbed all the treasure, right? I don't want that treasure back? It's completely worthless at this point. Besides, Kefka is the one we need to worry about. Those guys haven't committed any serious crimes. Come on, let's go. Yeah, let's go shake things up again, brother. Now we got two great people back. Need to cure the poison. Oh, uh, th oh, he's vanished. I thought that was a poison marker. Edgar, what, what can you use? You're equally kitted out with magic. Unless you want Blizzard real bad, which I don't think. Here, work on Madawin. Well, they missed out on the Soul Saber. I don't even know what the Soul Saber does. Where is it? I hate when things get jumbled. Swords, swords, show me swords. It's obviously a sword. Soul Saber. Drains MP and may cast death. And this one drains MP and might do criticals. So not as great as the stuff I have. Obviously an Edgar needs nothing. He needs nothing. Ah, there's my Ultima weapon! No relics, obviously. We'll do Ward Bangle and Haste Boots. Where's the Haste Boots? Where are they? There they are. Just to cut down on the encounters.
drop. Oh right, my security system is still in place. Now they got mad signals, bro. I could always just bop Sabin. I could bop Sabin. Stop it. Stop it. Yeah, get wrecked. Oh, you know what? That's helpful, actually. Yeah, you would just keep doing that. You go ahead and just keep doing that. Warp. What's the difference between teleport and warp? Magic. Where's warp? Sends an enemy to... Oh, this is X-Zone! This is the X-Zone spell. It does, like, a mass banish on everybody, and it has a funky... It has a funky interaction with Vanish? Or if you kill a boss with it, you don't get any of their drops. You don't get anything. Because you send it to the Astral Plane. So, not recommended. If you use Death, though, you still get drops and everything. Let's get out of Basement 2. Basement 2 sucks. I can't- I can't believe you built Basement 2, Edgar. It's filled with monsters. Oh good, the engine's been fixed! Nick, stop the surface! I thought you were suffocating. I thought you were suffocating. I guess not now, huh? The ventilation back on? Go to Kalingen? Uh, but maybe not just yet. There's shops here. Again. They got the chocobos out. Everything is as it was. Welcome back, King Edgar. Huh? Sabin? What a splendid young man you become. Make yourselves at home here. Gonna need him in the lead. So we can get those sweet discounts. Always been over this. You're taking the money. I think they have new tools in stock. Yep, the debilitator. Oh wait, we have one of those. How did I not notice it before? Can't see it here. It's on the tools. Swords... stuff... Debilitator. Assigns a random elemental weakness. I guess if you want to make an enemy weak to things, just hit them with that a bunch. I wonder if there's any lore going on in here. I don't remember there being any lore. I think the only lore we get is from the inn, and I think we already did that. Yes. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all we really need to do here. This is just a conduit to Kalingan. We're just constantly trying to get to Narsh. In the most roundabout, silly way possible. How'd I do that? How'd I walk outside? We can't get the Narsh from here! Can't get the Narsh from here! That's the world of balance! At least the deserts are still connected! That whole continent to the northeast. That's where Narsh is, in that general area. I forget who's next on the list of the recruitment, though. Seltzer, maybe?
a Marcosius. Oh, that's a pretty bird. Who wants a laser beam? Just decked out for Mardi Gras, aren't you? It's just a bird. It's just fancy looking bird out in nowhere. Welcome to Kalingan. Those beautiful days will never return. Oh, another flashback. And the birds were flying out of formation. Nash is filled with monsters. I don't have any place to go to. He's a real tough guy fighting in the Coliseum. Looks like he's looking for a weapon code to Ichigeki. Do we got... Do we got an Ichigeki? Do we have a one Geki? I think we only have a hundred Gek. Kotetsu, Kazakiri, Murasame. I don't think we have an Ichigeki. So unfortunately, there's also a Colosseum now. You could bid for big prizes. Those not now in your party. They're, they're already stripped anyway. It's a random thing to ask somebody. There's still some people in this world with dreams, like my younger brother up north, for instance. He built just a thing for a world like this. The Colosseum. Nothing good there. Um, you want diamonds? Cause boy, do we got diamonds! But have the money farm on the side again. Viper darts. I've heard this is useful because they might kill an enemy in one hit, and you could Genji glove them. I'll take a spear in case we ever find Mog again, and you can dry goon people. There's the dice. They deal more damage the higher they roll. But it's usually against your favor. They usually... There's a weird, like, formula for dice. Where one die shows how much the damage is multiplied, and the other die shows how much damage you're doing. And they usually just roll two and three. The fixed dice are in Kefka's Tower, and they're a lot better. I'm not confident of going there, because I don't know where the fixed dice are. I have some seeds, but nothing's growing. Don't step there to see- give the seeds a chance to sprout. I wonder if Locke is here. This is his girlfriend's house, after all. Is Locke in? No, no luck. Huh, luck? He must be searching for all over that world for that fabled treasure. Find the treasure and you'll find luck. Okay, thanks. Uh, uh, where can we look for treasure? I actually expected these scenes to be longer. We're doing a decent pace on getting these characters back. I mean, almost two hours in and we got Edgar and Sabin, like... Two of my strongest characters. I see something off to the west. Off in this direction. I'm not quite sure what it is. It might be Colosseum. Also, these things are called the bogey. What, what were they called in, um... The Southern Continent? Like, Dom or something like that? I can't remember. It was like three streams ago. What's this? Single house. I'm sure it's nothing. I'm sure it's nothing. You know, just, um, a data leak. Yeah. It's probably a data leak. No relevance there. Yep, 
Now that I know I can just teleport out of situations, I just want to teleport out of situations all the time. I could farm later! I don't even really have any spells that people need to learn. Needs more Magicite. I think Edgar has Teleport too. Uh, no, actually he doesn't. Fourth B slip! This is just the game acknowledging, hey, yeah, too many encounters. Even with the word bangle, you have too many encounters. Have, have a teleport. Oh, this guy's new. And he looks like he would absorb thunder. And he'd be resistant to physical. I hope he likes poison. No, just yellow slime guy in the middle of nowhere. I'll buy his lonesome. Is this Chocobo? I see a white dot here. There was a white dot there. I'm not crazy. It's a moose. It's a mouse. Well, it's not very physical resistant either. Why is it by itself? That is weird. Ah, the Colosseum, I see. Uh, uh, is that Ultros? The more precious the item wagered, the better the prize will be. Me, the great Ultros! Working as a receptionist at a stinking coliseum. Hey, you better not bet any cheap crap or Master Typhon will just come and punish you. Something tells me we need to find some cheap crap and that uh, lets us fight a Typhon. Yeah, there's a white dot there. Also, Dragon Head Peninsula is still Dragon and Head. They really didn't really give us much of a hint on where to go next. Ah, I see. It's poison immune. That's its only benefit, is this poison immune. There's a white dot here, but then there isn't. Oh, there it is. I don't really see a point in having a chocobo stable. But... Did you sure you can? Why? Why did he Shoryuken? There's nothing down this way, is there? I don't see anything. Is that Mystery House? Do I have to do more in, um, Kolingan? Because I've been everywhere else. I need to find an itchy... an itchy guy. I need to find an Izakai. Plants dead. searching around. Why do you ask me to unequip my party members? Maybe there's... Oh, uh, yep. Well, I'm a dummy. There's Seltzer. Seltzer! You're alive! 
come along with us. We're after Kefka. Phew. I don't know if I have it in me anymore. What are you saying? I'm just a gambler. My world has always been in a man's spirit, good soul, and free. Not anymore. It's like the weight of the world's crushing me. What's worse, I lost my wings. I've got some daggers and uh, knives for you to throw, and uh, the darts... stuff. Before the world collapsed, you fought with all your heart. You were absolutely fearless. That was then. I'd lost my dream. When times are tough, you have to follow your dreams. I dream of taking the world back, Seltzer. What about you? <laughs> All right, you win. I'm starting to feel lucky. Would you chase it after with me then, my dream? Oh, that, that was supposed to be, uh... Oh, it's Celeste nodded. Yeah, okay. Thanks, I needed that. Now let's go visit Daryl's tomb. You know where Daryl's tomb is, right? We're gonna get us another pair of wings! So that's where that whole uh, backstory before this terrible thing happened. We're gonna go find Daryl. That place is relevant now. I should do some equipment changing because uh, there's a cheese tactic. No more Genji glove for you. You know what? Anti-Confuse would be great. Anti-Confuse would be great. That causes problems. Or maybe a hero ring to boost magic. And we'll give Seltzer, first time we're actually officially using him, we'll give him a Genji glove. And a ribbon, just in case. And he's gonna dual wield Viper darts. Green Beret is still like some of the best things in the game. And Gold Armor seems fine. All right, Seltzer has like nothing to his name because I didn't use him. So did he just. Learn something. Kira grows okay on this guy. Two insta-death darts on a guy that could double attack. That's what we're going with here. So, he's a monstrosity against things that aren't undead or a boss. And I'm not even sure about the last part because of uh, Vanish. No, just take a shot. Take a shot. Okay, granted it's not guaranteed. But it'll death eventually. Let's try it again. Bullseye! Eh, it's a 1 in 3, like 33% chance. Next time it's Daryl's Tomb, but uh, I'm gonna get some people some levels, get money, get Seltzer some uh, magic. And we're gonna go to Daryl's Tomb. Maybe we'll find uh, that whatever that is that somebody in the Colosseum is looking for. But welcome to the world of ruin. Of course, it happens right before Tears of the Kingdom! Which, unfortunately, as I mentioned before, I will not be streaming because I don't have a capture card. So the only other way to play it is to do Yoho Piracy. I don't even know how well that would work. But the thanks, for, uh, thanks for showing up to the stream. Next Thursday, more Final Fantasy VI. We got Pokemon on Saturday, the end of Cult of the Lamb on Saturday. The usual. 
Me, I'm going to be leaving the house in about three hours to go to a midnight release of uh, Tears of the Kingdom. And I'm just going to play that till I pass out. So, good night, everybody.